Hello guys, welcome to Learn Electronics. Today we will learn about Arduino based home automation using TV remote. So let's get started. So this is the circuit diagram. So we are using an Arduino Uno and an IR receiver. So the IR receiver we are using is a VS838 IR receiver. So it's a 3 pin IR receiver. The leftmost pin is, con is the signal pin which is connected to a digital pin 11 of the Arduino. The ground is connected to the ground of the Arduino. And the 5 volt supply pin is connected to the V in of the Arduino. On the other side you can see a 2 channel relay module. You can use as many number of relay modules as you want. You can use even 8 channel relay module. But for simplicity we have kept it as a 2 relay module channel. On top of each relay you can see the specification of the relay. Here it states 250 volt AC and 10 amps of current. So I can use AC voltage for this project. On the left side you have 4 pins. The ground is connected to the ground of the Arduino. The VCC is connected to the 5 volts of the Arduino. The IN1 and IN2 are two pins which are used to control the relay 1 and relay 2. So the IN1 and IN2 are connected to digital pin 8 and 9 of the Arduino respectively. On the other side of the relay you can see three pins, a closed pin, a common pin and an open pin. The common pin is connected to one terminal of the AC bulb and the other terminal of the AC bulb goes to one, ter one terminal of the power supply. The open pin of the relay is directly connected to the neutral of the power supply. The same way the other AC bulb is also connected. This is all regarding the circuit diagram. So let's see the coding. So to run this coding we need to include a library which is a IR remote library. To include the library let's go to sketch, include library, manage libraries and wait for a minute. the library manager will pop up. On the search bar you have to search IR remote. It's loading. I R R E M O T E So here you can see IR remote by Sheriff which I have already installed. Pin 11 receives the data from the IR receiver. This is a code that we get from the TV remote when you press a button. So the each button is having its unique code. We will know how to find the code in the later video. Here the pin 9 is assigned to the relay 1 and pin 8 is assigned to the relay 2. These are some of the functions which are from the IR remote library. Here we are starting the receiver and we are assigning the pin of relay 1 and 2 as output and the output to be low. Here we are checking for input from the IR receiver and we are storing the value into a variable called code. If the value in the code matches with the above mentioned value then the light is on and if again we press the same button then the light will become off. So the same thing is done to the relay too. This is how the coding works. So let's do the project. 
here i have connected the ir receiver to the arduino according to the circuit diagram now let's connect the arduino to the pc and upload the code meanwhile this is the tv remote that i am going to use The code is done uploading. Now go to tools and open serial monitor. And with the help of the TV remote, I am going to press a button. For example, I am going to press the volume up button. When you press the button, you will see there is a code appearing on the serial monitor. That is the code for that specific button. Now I am going to press the OK. and now you are seeing different code so each button will have each code so this is how we are going to get the code according to the each button now you can replace the code to the code relay 1 or code relay 2 according to which button you want to use to turn the light on or off now we have connected everything according to the circuit diagram It's a bit messy but everything is perfect. We have a IR receiver, we have a two channel relay, the Arduino and two LED bulbs. Since we are working with AC supply, please make sure that you take the required precautions before working with the AC supply. So let's upload the code now. Now I am going to upload the code. it's compiling and it's done uploading now i'm going to turn on the light with the help of the minus button now i'm going to press the minus button once i have clicked the minus button you can see the bulb one is lighten up now let's open the tools and serial monitor Now we can see that we have enabled the IR receiver. Now once I'm once again I'm going to press the minus button. And you can see tube lights on. Now I'm going to press press the plus button. And you can see the another bulb is also on. Now I'm going to press the same button again. Now you can see the tube lights are off. Now I am going to the plus button again. Now you can see the bulb 2 is also off. This is how the coding works. Hope you like the video. Please share and subscribe to learn electronics. Thank you.